The Translate Layer tool translates or moves all objects on a selected layer. For example, say you have a star in a circle on one layer and another shape on a second layer. In the Layers palette, select the layer that contains the star and circle. Then drag in the scene to move an entire layer to the new position. You can animate the movement, advance to a later point in the timeline, and move the position of the layer with the Translate Layer tool. There are 240 frames in an animation by default, but you can increase the end frame value to make it longer. When you scrub back and forth in the timeline between the original position and the new position, you'll see the layer move. A blue line represents the motion path that the layer will move along. You can use the Show Path setting in the toolbar to show or hide the path. You can also position the layer by entering the X, Y, and Z positions in the toolbar. If your mouse has a scroll wheel, you can use it to increase or decrease the setting. You can also enter numerical values through the keyboard. X moves left to right, Y moves up and down, and Z moves the object closer or farther away in 3D space. Use the Reset button to reset the coordinates back to the original values. Two buttons in the toolbar at the top allow you to flip the layer horizontally or vertically.